Hey everyone, Liam here from Customer Success. We've recently launched authenticated web app scanning, so I'm gonna show you how to get started. In-depth information about this release can be found on both our website and in our help center. I'll be referencing these resources throughout this short video, so be sure to check them out. Step one, add a target. To add a target, simply visit the targets page, click the add target button and add the details of the web app you wish to scan. When adding a web app, you can either use a fully qualified domain name or IP address. In this example, we'll be using a fully qualified domain name. Step two, add an authentication. To do this, we need to visit the target details page, which you can access by clicking on your target. Click the add button in the authentication section and a modal will appear. Here, you can choose which authentication method you would like to add. For this video, we'll be focusing on form-based authentication as it's the most popular. Guides for the other types of authentications can be found in our help center. When we select form-based authentication, you will be presented with the following modal. I'm gonna quickly add details of a test web application we own, but for you, ensure you're entering details specific to your web app, as the information here is crucial for the scanner to perform its job correctly. Remember to refer to our support articles if you're having difficulties with this. Once you've added the required information, you will see the authentication appear in the authentication section. Now your target is ready to scan, which is step three. To scan your target, visit the scans page where you can either schedule a scan to take place at a specific time and date, or you can start an on-demand scan, which will take place straight away. That's all for now. If you have any questions or feedback regarding authenticated scanning, please get in touch with the team as we'd love to hear from you.